what are you prepared for in this uh, go around with them? Um, pretty much what I was prepared for three, the last time, three years ago. Boxing, uh, tricky jiu-jitsu, good cardio. For the both of you, it's been kind of a rough patch with the last few fights. Uh, what do you see this playing in as a, a, a part of you getting back on track? I mean, it's a huge part. You always want to want to um, you know kind of get get back on on track, and that's the way to do it. Win, winning solves everything. We talked a little bit this morning uh, about the TJ Grant fight and how much you reflected on that since uh, that fight happened. Uh, ahead of that fight, though, you said that you had some knee issues and there's a lot going on with you. Before that fight, yeah. Uh, now that you know you've kind of gotten back on track, how how ready do you feel? Do you feel like everything's 100% this time around? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm prepared to go at it, and uh, and you know, TJ Grant. There's no excuse for that. Like, I, I just, um, my mind, you always look at the last camp and what can change, how you can get better. And, and those were a couple things that, that I looked at. Like, I need to be in the, the gym more. Um, the knee kind of held me out. And so, you know, you just look at, like, why you need to get better, um, how you can get better. And so when we're talking, it's not like that's an excuse. Like, oh, yeah, I had that knee injury. That's why T.J. Grant beat me. He, you know, he came in prepared, and, uh, you know, he did a great job and no excuse for, you know, to lose. You just look at, look at, look at, like, what you did and, and kind of how to change it and evolve. Nate was over there talking about wanting to get to Anthony Pettis and going through Josh Thompson again. Uh, do you feel like there's any part of him maybe that might be looking past you ahead of the fight? I mean, that's on him if he is, you know. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm geared up for him. And if he is, how much of an advantage do you feel like that plays for you? You know, I don't really look at what what he does and where he's at. I'm just prepared for the best Nate. You know, I'm prepared for him to come at me, and uh, you know, you know, I try to be the best Gray that I can be. You know, and um, so my opponent, I don't really care what they where they're at, minds and all that stuff. I don't look at that. You know, I only control me, and that's it. Well, we want to wish you all the best of luck, Gray. Thank Take you. care.